Hawaiian lunch hour in the kitchen with the team from Crazy on Helens, and we're making shrimp and grits. Chef Jacob, those are seared perfectly. Talk to me about what we're doing. So uh, we did our, our loaded grits that we do at brunch because nothing is better than bacon and shrimp. Uh, break every rule, you know? Um, so we uh, seared the shrimp, uh, we put our pimento cheese, some bacon bits that we make in-house, and then uh, some really tasty grits. Oh, it looks amazing. I love the pimento cheese. We sampled it. It's incredible. Fried green tomatoes, the boiled peanuts, everything's amazing. So we'll get that plated up, Jacob, and we'll bring it over so Jennifer and Marissa and myself can sample it. Yeah. And let me tell you, we're ready for a show because as I'm talking to you, my earring fell out of my ear and down my dress. Really? And that's just a preview for what's about to come. <laughs> One of these, by the way. Yeah. Oh, it's we are. not stuck in we'll there. Get you one. Oh, it's in, in my. It's, it's in there. Not what okay. it's supposed to be right okay. now. Got it. Speaking we'll of work it performance, out. Tara Hooch, she's here to give us a little peek at a big event that she has coming up at Crazy Ooh. on Helens. Take it away. <laughs> Fantastic. Thank you, Joe. Let me know if you need any background dancers. Oh, I love I, a good background dancer. Perfect, dance. perfect. But this is all part of a big bingo and show event that you have coming up soon. Come that on. is right, darling. You yeah. know, I, Shane opened up Crazy Aunt Helen's for me to start performing. I've done a year of bingo in a show. It's not just bingo, mm -hmm. it's a delicious dinner and a fabulous show. And it's coming up February 18th. February 18th is when it's going to be. Yes, darling. So tell me about your, your art. Because, I mean, this is creativity, and you do so much for the community. So it goes beyond just the show itself. Just, so this is a pandemic hobby yeah. that actually started. And really? it is. This is kind of a, and it just kind of grew and blew up. And so some people are making sourdough bread starter. I bought 27 wigs, okay. darling. All right. <laughs> yeah. and my husband loves that. All right. And, and it's just been, it's been a beautiful way for me to connect with people. Really? And I do story time brunches. I do trivia. I mean, it's just a, it's a blast. It's so much fun. Yeah, it's a lot of fun. I could feel that here in our studio. So since you just got started in this space, tell me about the makeup and how you mastered oh. it. Oh, darling. You know, so I ended up watching a lot of videos. Yeah. I've watched a lot of RuPaul's Drag Race, and I just kind of watch them. that's my favorite. Yes, and they just sit there in front of that mirror with those sponges and blend. <laughs> so that's what I did. I did a lot of trial and error. If you scroll back on my Instagram, you'll see some scary pre 
fabulous Tara pictures, yeah. right? So it's, just, it's a lot of growth and it's fun to do. You know, I've also taken, I call it YouTube University. Yes, <laughs> Where you can get all, all the tips. Yes. Yeah, so Crazy Aunt Helen's, and I was telling a, a friend this off air, you get the good food, you get a good time. Tell me what it means to you as a performer, as a member of our community here, to know that you really make a difference because sometimes people are just feeling down and they're just like, I don't know what to do. And then they go to Crazy Aunt Helen's and the world's all right. It is amazing. Yeah. You know, you can, I love connecting with people. And I talk to people from all over the country that come. Mm -hmm. And you know, some of them are surprised to see a drag queen and they're excited about it. Some of them are maybe a little bit terrified, all right? But it's all about making people feel comfortable and to know that they're gorgeous. Yeah. That's my catchphrase, is, darling, you're gorgeous. Whether you're mm -hmm. having a bad day, you're gorgeous. Keep being gorgeous. Yeah, you have to keep saying that and know that for yourself if no one else says it. Absolutely. Absolutely. So for people who just watched your performance and they're like, you know what, I want to be there on the 18th. What yes. do they need to do? Do they need to get tickets? You need or? to get tickets. And I'm going to have Shalita Rahman and Foxy Moron are going to be oh, my guests, I love too. Foxy. All right, yes. yes. So we're going to have some folks. You can go to the Eventbrite page, go to crazyouthelens.com. You can find me on Instagram and we'll have the tickets there. There is Instagram at terahoot.com. You can go to terahoot.com and see that or go to Crazy Aunt Helens and check out um, all of the events we have. It's not just me at Crazy Aunt Helens. There are tons of performers. Okay, well, that song was Good Day and we, you know, yes. we have Good Day DC. That's right. Uh, can you all do a Lion Lunch Hour song at some point? And maybe it can be our theme song. Oh, we'll definitely work on that, yeah. darling. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> I can already hear Melody. Yes. We'll work so we'll on that. Yes, we'll figure it out. Absolutely. <laughs>